Let's take you to meet Taiwanese artist Li Kui Bi. She's holding an exhibition titled Banana Coin, which is centered on bananas, a colonial cash crop in Taiwan. Through the exhibition, Li hopes to bring awareness to problems in the banana industry and pose questions about our modern day perceptions of trade and currency. FTV reporter Stephen Yang spoke to Li to find out more about her exhibition. Scan the QR code to try a game of banana picking. If you can accumulate 2,000 points in 10 minutes, you'll win a prize in the form of an NFT. It's an exceptionally difficult challenge, but nothing compared to the quotas imposed on a real-life banana orchard worker. Through this game, Banana Coin, artist Lee Kui B hopes to bring to light problems in the banana industry. You can uh, join the auction and uh, to bid your uh, copper banana. Banana industry is uh, a global industry and you have a lot of problems and a lot of issues. They, uh, they have some NGO is uh, also do research and uh, remind people that uh, uh, that uh, uh, the problem met from banana platform and the banana company. And so I, I think uh, uh, alone, this project now is talking about the uh, very have a relationship with Taiwanese history, but actually it can be more global, and uh, we can make a new link uh, with uh, other countries and uh, other like a banana farmer, and uh, and uh, it can be it can be be a new platform uh, to have a more conversation about about this issue in the future. This work, Weather Forecast of Banana Plantation, is a video installation that was created by combining images of banana money banknotes with a real-time weather tracker, Google Weather. By integrating these two elements, the weather conditions of former colonial banana plantation sites are then synchronized and presented on a projection screen. This video is a link with uh, Google, and uh, the voice is uh, uh, it's making fun. Uh, we, we use some AI technology and uh, also with, with, some, uh, uh, with some music. And uh, in all the video, we are talking about the colonization, uh, colon, colony history in Taiwan and also the banana in, in, induced, induced tea. Li received her MFA degree from Taipei National University of the Arts in 2017. Her works mainly focus on landscapes that are neglected under globalization. One topic she has done extensive research on is Cambodia's Diamond Island. In her newest solo exhibition, Lee focuses on bananas, a colonial cash crop in Taiwan. She aims to bring to light the contradictions of contemporary trading systems in relation to the structures of colonialism. She also explores how colonialism history connects with the present-day economic situation in Taiwan. We are talking about uh colony history, we are talking about colonization and uh, we are talking about uh, globalization also today's economic situation after COVID-19. Actually, have, they have relationship. So in this project, I want to remind everyone or uh, remind people that uh, our history and the today's uh, economic, situation, uh, e economic system, actually, is, uh, we have a very deep uh, relationship and uh, we are not, we are not alone. We are, actually, we are linked with uh, other countries, or uh, we are linked with the world. Uh, actually, for for very long time. But we, we maybe sometimes we are too busy, and uh, so we we don't have enough time to uh, focus on it. Lee's solo exhibition will be held at the Home Foundation till December 16th. FTV reporter Stephanie Yang and Guo Wenhai in Taipei.